Welcome to Good Mythical More. I've seen many mythical beasts, maybe yes. you, posting AI generated images of us, and I've been puzzled by it, fascinated by it, and now I'm gonna experience more of it. We've gotta work backwards to see what the mythical crew has inserted into AI, which then spit out art based on art, mythical themes. I'm excited too. But first, I'm excited about taking a new selfie face. This one's called Doggy Daycare called and said your dog can't come back. Oh, are you embarrassed? Are you mad? I, don't know. Yeah, I uh, stick the tongue out. No, I, we'll leave that up to the AI. I don't know. I don't know exactly what I would do. My dogs are very subdued, you know? They're not gonna cause too much trouble. But if that happened, you'd be like, could you explain this to me? It's like, what? I don't know what my dog Show me the video know. footage. Oh. So, okay, you know, usually people use an engine called Dolly Mini for yes. these. Yeah. I'm Today with this. we used Dream by Wombo. Okay. Uh, it's designed to give you artistic images that you can generate in several different styles. Mm. So, we're gonna show you three images each round in different art styles. So it's a single like mythical related phrase we've went, we've entered in okay. and you can see three images to try and guess what it is. So See, the thing that I didn't realize with using Dolly and the, um, the all the images of us that have been going around Twitter was that I just assumed that people would load an image and then it would be altered or like a series That's a of images. filter. But that's, yeah, that would just be a filter. So I didn't really think the, about, you're giving they're it, typing in like Retin Link doing so and so and then it, goes, is going on, on the it goes into the internet and then making art out of it. But okay. here's the thing, those all look sort of weird and like abstract, right? And there's panels. But I have seen the new, the Dolly Not Mini, which I don't believe at the time uh, that last I checked, was not available to the public yet. You could like apply to like get it. Oh, you're special. And or no, because uh, Joe Pinna, Mystery Guitar Man, yeah. now th acclaimed uh, film director, <clears throat> made a video about it. I don't know if it was a sponsorship deal or not. Oh, cool. Um, but he was showing these images, and they look completely real. Like, they look like persons. So like, man holding Red Balloon looking confused at his phone. It'll be like, boom, and there it is, and it's oh, wow. the like exact a deep fake. same. So basically, stock image models, they're a good thing of the past. Once this thing goes live, you're not gonna need a stock image person. What about like subclass Halloween costume model? I think we can still use those. Can, can you, let's see one. We can still use those. All right, so, oh yes, this is exactly what I'm talking about. So what, Love, Moonwalker, and Synth Wave. These are the styles that we chose. Hmm. Well, I think that might be me and you. Oh, well, I think it, it, I well, think it's just you. you no, no, no. Am you I in what? there? I think that that one of those might be Chase. I think it is. If you I look at the it, middle, it's Rhett and Chase. Rhett and Chase dancing the night away. But is this a known phrase, like something that uh, we've said before, or something no, more like Rhett and Chase dancing the said. night away? You were close with your guess, but not correct. First of all, it is Rhett and Chase. Incorrect. It's Rhett and Link. It's Chase and Chase. It's two Chases. No. It's Rhett and Link. Yeah. Well, why do I look like Chase? This one's a pretty straightforward Rhett one. Rhett and to Link lead dancing. Off. Yep, there we go. <laughs> Rhett and Link dancing. Why is it Chase? Why do I look like Chase? Definitely the one in the middle and the one looks like Chase on the right. So then. The one on the left, the guy on the right, I assumed was Chase. I don't know how to feel about this, just from cool, a, from a, like an existential <clears throat> place, because I feel like if I were the kind of artist, like a human artist who made this type of art, which if I didn't know about the AI art, so ten, you know, five years ago or last year, whatever, it'd be worth paying for. I'd be like, oh, this dude on the internet made this really awesome painting of us, and it's like weird and abstract. And I'd be like, man, that's like requires this incredible skill because it, it would. How does that person feel? Like this is someone's style, and now it's just being done by AI. Like this is—I don't, don't know if synth moonwalker, synth wave, love are those. I just don't styles? know how to feel about this in general. I think it's cool, man. I'm, don't think about it. <laughs> how do you feel about this? Oh wow! Vibrant, 
Pro Provenance. What's Provenance? Mystical. That mystical one is. So that's like a a moon with two faces, and it might be. That's I think that's me and you, or it could be you and Chase, <laughs> and overlooking like a like a a storm thrown sea. So there's an ocean in, on all of them. So I would be, you know, like that far, especially the far left one. Wow. Okay. Ocean? And a sun, look. Ocean at, Rhett Link on the ocean at night. Um, This one's definitely a lot more of a stretch than the first one. They're all sunsets too. They're like, they've got that sunset. Are they sunsets? Sunrises. Could be a sunrise. Mm -hmm. Ocean sunrise with your boys, Rhett and Link. <laughs> What's in the middle one though? Is that like? I don't know, that's awesome though. Is it like demon tadpoles in the sky? Yeah, demon tadpoles in the sky for sure. I mean, this is like a. I would put any of these up if, in like if I owned a chain of hotels. You know how you can put that kind of abstract art in like the hallways of the hotel? That's another outlet for this stuff. Like hotel art people? Forget yeah. about it. You're over. I'm just they, I, they got to change their we, riches. We are They're watching too jobs being completely decimated in real time. Because if I was running the hotel wow. chain, I'd be like, I'm just gonna type some words in here and put them all over the all our locations. I would not put the mystical <laughs> version of not this. Not the mystical in a hotel. one. No, but the vibrant would work totally. I mean, you'd put like in like something like like things that make you happy at a hotel, like late checkout. Ooh, and then see what that generates. Yes. You could put that up and then people would start to feel like you feel when you call them and you're like, can I get a late checkout? And they're like, yes. They're like, yes. Extra biscuit in your uh, in your biscuit Room box. service. Unexpected biscuit at room service. Type that in there. Unexpected <laughs> biscuit. That's a good band name. Unexpected biscuit, right. The entire hotel room is clean, except there's something in the bottom of the trash can that I'm afraid to ask what it is. Oh, it's another bag. Oh. And then you're okay. So what was this, Steve? This is like really. I think this is good. You typed in good mythical morning. Yes, Link. That's, That's it, it, right? Yep. Yes. Good mythical what? morning. Hey. It's a sunrise. This is amazing. This is what good mythical morning. This is what robots think about good mythical morning. I like how they it put us in this in the moon. Okay, this is a little bit weird, and maybe this is obvious, but like the color palette, especially the vibrant one, many of our iterations of our poster and logo is orange and blue because of those sort of contrasting complementary colors. Maybe AI saw that. Just saw those things. Yeah, it's not like the you know. I mean, AI immediately watched all episodes of the show. It's almost like thousands. the color of the wheel, like the color palette of the wheel of mythicality. There's not enough without green. without green. There's, the green is missing, especially on the the ones on the end. Okay. How about this? Wow, Stevie, this is crazy. So it's cotton candy color. This is awesome, by the way. Like, I don't know. I I didn't think I was an abstract art person, but I am seeing that I am. I'm an AI art guy. It kind of has a Tron lighting thing happening to it. It's like neon. Drinking in the future. This is a Good Mythical Morning related uh Well, I mean, the phrase. woman in the middle is, is you. You're Stevie. No. But, you, but you're not in the other two. But what um, is? Pink, pink mugs. The one on the far Cup. right looks like a shattered good mythical mug. Looks like a beer pong on the far right. Like that looks like a, a red solo cup growing out of like a rock formation. Is there stuff coming, like coffee mug? Is there, co there's liquid in, in some of these. That is a per, that is a person there in the middle one. But it's not Cotton Candy Randy. No. Well, we know it's a cup. A mug. A, a cup. A cup. A cup. What does a cup have to do with good Sometimes money? we wear a cup when we're gonna get kicked in the nuts on this show. It's a phrase. Dink it and sink it. A phrase with the word cup. 
not my cup of it's not it's my, not cup, my cup to pee. Yep, yep, yep. It's not yep. my cup of tea. Yep. Is that is that exactly what was put in? Not not my cup of tea. Uh, which, which was I it? think it, it was. It's it's not my. It's cup not of tea. my cup of tea. Oh, interesting. Okay. Is that supposed to? Is that supposed to be triggering for me? Because while you're letting is. while you're letting that sink in, uh, you know we've been over there on the society just competing team Rhett versus team Link and these society showdowns, party games yeah. over the past two weeks. So there's, yeah. there's two videos out there, um, and you, you can watch those now if you want to. But uh, we are doing uh, tomorrow at 3 p.m. Pacific. We are doing the ultimate final society showdown. Ultimate party game champion will be determined, Team Rhett or Team Link, because we've been keeping up with the points. Okay, so join us if you're third degree. You gotta be third degree Mythical Society to watch it live tomorrow. Totally live. It's uh, 3 p.m. Pacific, right? Yeah. Pacific, that's right. Yep, that's 6 p.m. Eastern. Yep. Mythicalsociety.com. And the videos that are already out, we did um, uh, Nasty Food Jenga, and we played we're still, We're still good. We're still good. We're still good. Okay, this one. one's really cool. See now, okay, this, that's is, cotton candy this is cotton candy, Randy. Yeah. Look at how how much cotton candy there is there, and that's what Randy looks like to AI. What is I that? Mean, it is there any other piece of it? Or do we no? Get it? Yeah, cotton candy. Randy. So love. I just Ghibli. Am I the only one who is deeply disturbed. moved by these? Like you're gonna cry. Like, I, I I feel like. You don't. You seem to be like disassociating a little bit from it. Like you're kind of making fun of it a little bit. Like I'm blown away with the artistic integrity of AI. Like if a person were to send us these in the mail and be like, "I did a little painting of Cotton Candy Randy," we talk about it for weeks. Yeah. Okay. I see your point. Just think about it for a second. This is amazing. This is beautiful. This is life changing. Am I wrong? No. I'm not wrong. I'm getting. Yeah. I'm getting nods. You're not wrong. The it's life changing. On the, yeah, yeah. The one on the left. It looks like he's blowing a bubble. That is cotton candy. Yeah. It's it, that whole like ambiguity, open to interpretation. He's got a unibrow. Like the the pompadour nature of the hair and the love interpretation, but then the psychedelic interpretation with the hair coming out of the side and like just look at. I mean, look what's happening there. Look yeah. at the texture on the hair. Okay, this one I think you'll get as well. This is a, I got a pickle Will in the middle burger. of a burger covered oh, in chocolate. Yes. Yep, yep, yep. Fantasy art. Now, pickle in the middle. I'm not as impressed of a with this one. Burger covered in, it, it, I mean, it's very specific. But the color scheme is, this is like, um, this is like in the basement of the hotel. That is cool. It's like, oh, we got to put something down there. Okay, and finally, this is like, this oh, is like fine art. Mooshell, oh my gosh! That's, you just put in Mooshell and this came no, out? No, there's more, there's more. What do you think the more? Dancing, part? like fancy, fancy Mooshell. Well, we had to define Mooshell a little bit. Oh, so dancing cow dancing in, fancy in red cow. dress. In red in a red dress dress, <laughs> Michelle, a humanoid cow, in a red dress. Each one has something to offer, like the Baroque style with the way it looks like it might be like a whole cow down there at the bottom. You but know what what's I'm saying? happening at the top? Can I don't even help? know. It's like, yeah, it's a little disturbing. But the Moonwalker one is got this very sci-fi, like you could. You could imagine an entire like series and she, done in this style. She's looking right at us. And then steampunk is just it's just beautiful and and that's a big Mooshell. Well you are you you're really being moved emotionally here. I think I'm just preparing myself to worship the robot overlords because if they're this good at art, think about what else they're gonna be good at. You know it is it, it is scary. I just don't know. I feel like what you're in do you're in it. denial. That's what I sense you're in a deep denial, like you're, it makes you uncomfortable, and so you're not letting yourself emotionally connect with it. And I'm probably too easily emotionally connecting with what the robots are trying to do to us. And, um, but you, you know, know I, well, I've seen the deep fakes, and I've been, I've been that that's very disturbing. I'm just ready for the robots to bring me just a teat filled with 
you know, sweet nectar, and I'm just gonna suck on it all day long. I think that's one of those like machines that like uses you, me as a battery, like in the Matrix. No, where you can just get any type of soft drink you want. <laughs> oh, you're talking about a a Coke? Uh, what do you call that thing? Freestyle, a Coca Cola Coke. freestyle. <laughs> yeah. You want a Coca-Cola freestyle for the this rest is, of your the life. The ironic thing is that, or the, the the serendipitous thing, is that last time we went to a movie theater, and I was and I had one of those. I told Jesse I was like, just one day, like maybe when the kids are out of the house, <laughs> splurge. I would like to splurge on a Coke freestyle machine in the house, <laughs> because think about if you had one of those and people came over for parties, but they got a Coca-Cola freestyle machine in the house. I mean, you could have one that had liquors in it. And it would be, sure. and it would mix them together, just like a fancy coffee maker. Yeah. What does that exist? Like a like a it bartender. Does. Bartesian. They're like little curds. It's like the Bartesian. Bartesian. Really. Mm-hmm. And it's only going to get more. But you got to buy a pod to put in it. Yeah. It, it's, you know, it doesn't. It doesn't have all of like the different liquors in it. You push a button, and it's like I'll take an old fashioned. It has the pod, or it has the liquor you put in yourself. Uh, okay, oh. well, I'm gonna do Coca-Cola Freestyle with rum. See, now my mind is blown. Yeah, see, gotcha. Need mythical merch in a hurry? Try Amazon.com slash mythical for grooming, logo wear, and reissued designs delivered with lightning-fast prime shipping.